Carlos Thomas. Well, this spot of earth will hold the form of one whose memory you love and cherish. We are not here today with only sorrow. We are here with hope as well. We believe that to be absent from the body is to be present with the Lord and that to die is gain. We therefore commit this body to the ground and in a renewed and fresh hope of the return of Jesus Christ at whose appearing the dead will rise first and after that we who are alive and remain will be caught up together with him in the clouds and so will we be forever with the Lord. Let's say the verses of scripture that bring so much peace and brought to the psalmist as he penned them, the 23rd Psalm. Say it with me. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me, and thy rod and thy staff they comfort me. Though the Christ is able to hold me in the presence of my enemies, though anoint my head with oil, my cup runs over, show me goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. There's comfort in knowing that Carlos is in the presence of the Lord. When we leave this place, we would be nothing if we didn't have the hope that we would be in the presence of the Lord. When we leave this body, to think that there is nothing after death would be hopeless. But we are full of hope today because of Jesus Christ. Amen. Would you bow your heads as we pray? Lord, Almighty God, maker of heaven and earth, the one that we trust and adore, may today you heal and comfort and sustain the family and friends of Carlos Thomas. And grant us, Lord, by your grace, forgiveness, mercy, and only the comfort that you can give. Enfold us within the fellowship of your love and in the household of faith. Enlighten us as we seek you in this difficult time. Deepen our trust in you through this hard place. Help us face what we must in the coming days with hope and faith through Christ Jesus our Lord. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Among the things <coughs> Carlos hated was cold weather. It's no coincidence that today is so beautiful. Amen? Amen. He was also an Alpha man, a proud member of Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated. And the Alphas are here to pay tribute and allow us just two minutes just to sing the Alpha Hymn as is tradition for our brotherhood. Dearly art thou, will 
cherish thy precepts, thy banner shall be raised. To thy glory, thy honor and renown. O Lord, may the true spirit of the Trinity rule our hearts, guide our thoughts, and control our lives so that we may become true thee. Eight five eight, eight one nine oh six.
the address for the repass is on the program, so you're all invited to come spend a little time with the family, have some refreshments, and get closure to this very sad day. Thank you all for coming.